When we think about the role women play in our society, you can go to any Aboriginal community anywhere in Australia and the strongest voice will be that of a woman. This year's NAIDOC theme, because of her, we can, is important to me and to all of us because women are the strong core of our resilient communities. The woman who most influenced me is Nellie Rodney. My mother, Stephanie Taylor. My mother, Sylvia Lockyer. Lowett Chiro Donoghue. She was the first Aboriginal Australian to ever speak at the United Nations General Assembly. My mother, Emma Ryan, and also my grandmother, Jennifer Henry. My grandmother, Yibi, is portrayed in The Rabbit Proof Fence. She was one of the first owners of a cattle station. My mum, Hilda George. Mum was one of the very first nurses here in Western Australia. Uh, my auntie, Kate, and Kate was the first Aboriginal lawyer. And then finally, it was the sister of my best friend, also my best friend as well, and that's Colleen Haywood. My mother, Kim Gate. My mum, Gail Barry. My nana, Thelma Bennett. A Christine Arnoux. My mum, Naomi Latke. Faith Bandler and what she did before the 67 referendum. Seeing her constantly in the media and really strong and powerful and, and motivating people. And my mum, Rachel Mazza. My grandmother, Mavis Mann. She used to be part of the committee of OPAL, which is kind of like NAIDOC, and it would also have to be the daughters that she had who followed in her footsteps. My daughter, Cordelia, because I had to change everything about my life. That would be my mother, Belinda Osler. Irene Nanup, who is an Aboriginal health worker who took me under her wing and became a really strong mentor and colleague. They're not afraid to speak their mind. Because she has a big heart that can fill a room. Every time she gets knocked down, she gets back up again. She's just been the strongest person by my side and who I've looked up to forever. Because Auntie Nellie was prepared to put her life on hold, it gave Dad and his sisters a stable domestic environment in which to grow up and be given amazing opportunities such as going to school. Her influence sustained through the generations and gave us opportunities that some other Aboriginal families are still waiting to access. She aspires to be the change she wants to see in the world. Because she's always supported my education and learning. Because every day she got up, she always had a smile, always sung, and had so much beauty throughout all the things that have happened to her in life. She was our, well, she was the strength in our family. She was kind of everything and she believed in all of us. She always told me I could. It was always I can in my household. They are our mothers, our elders, our grandmothers, our aunties, our sisters, and of course our daughters. When we think of Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander women, they are inspirational. Empowering. Tenacious. Strong. Courageous. Beautiful. Family. Rebellious. Bright. Proud. They give birth to us. Kind and forgiving. Quiet achievers. They are the core of our communities. Sometimes a little wild. <laughs> because of her. I can. 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 And because of her, we can. can.